pre-k this week we have a new theme and it's called technology now technology is science we use to create useful things and solve problems now technology can make things we do faster make our lives a little easier did you know that this is a form of technology do you know what this is you're right it's my cell phone that's technology and you are, you are using technology today you are seeing this video on your computer so you use technology and I use technology your moms and dads use technology well today we're going to read a book called blackout now blackout is when the power goes out all throughout a city and when the power goes out that means when you go to your light switch <gasps> there are no lights well, when there's a blackout, guess what? You can't use technology. So I wonder what they're going to do in their book when they don't have any cell phones to use or computers or video games. Should we see? Blackout by John Rocco. So blackout means the power goes out. What are they using as lights? Good job, they're using flashlights. Have you ever used a flashlight? We have when the power goes out. So let's see what happens in our book, Blackout. It started out as a normal summer night. The city was loud and hot. The garbage trucks are going through the streets. Taxis are going beep, beep, and people are out and all the lights are on. Music is playing. Inside, everybody's busy. Sister's talking on her cell phone. Mom's working on her computer. Dad's cooking dinner. And little sister, it looks like she has a board game to play. She goes to her big sister, but guess what? Does she want to play? No, she yells out because she's busy talking on her phone. So little sister goes downstairs, but mom and dad are much too busy. Dad's cooking dinner, mom's doing work on her computer. They can't play a board game right now. So little sister goes back up to her room and then what does she do? She's playing a video game all by herself. But then the lights went out. Uh oh. How do you think she feels? Look at her eyes. I think she's a little afraid. All of the lights are out. So do you know what she yells? I bet you can read this word. M-O-M. -M. Can you yell it with me? Mom! And here comes mom running upstairs with her flashlight. Nothing worked at all. The cell phone didn't work. All the lights are out. What are they going to do? The city was now dark and quiet. And still, we huddled around flashlights and candles. Do you know what huddle means? They all sat together closely in the living room and look dad is making shadow puppets on the wall <gasps> and scared the cat by making a dog yow says the cat until it was too hot and sticky to sit inside hmm, if it's too hot and sticky to sit inside where do you think they decided to go do you think outside let's see can we go? She's pointing up. Now remember, they live in this city. They live in an apartment. So up they go to the rooftop. And they found La 
lights. What lights did they find? Did they find the lights on the bulletin, on the bulletin board over here? Nope, because the electricity's out. Hmm, what kind of lights do you see? Do you see the stars? God made those stars. They don't need electricity to work. So they see those lights. And they saw other people. It was a block party in the sky. We waved to everyone and then we heard other sounds below. I wonder what they could hear. So we went down and down and down all the way to the street outside. Come on. A party was going on there too. Look at this. The ice cream vendor is still selling ice cream. This family is sitting out on their porch and they're singing songs. These guys are playing in water in the streets with their mom and their dad. No one was busy now at all. Look, they're all together. When the lights came back on, what do you think they did? Shall we see? Everything went back to normal. She went back to her video game. Big sister's back on her cell phone. Mom goes to work on her computer. Dad's fixing the clock, getting it set back to its time. So do you know what she does? What does this switch do? When it's up, it means what? You're right, it means the lights go on. What do you think she does to this switch? What do you think she's going to do? It says, click. What do you think she did? You're right. She turned off the lights. But not everyone likes normal. So with the lights off, sister says, you know what? I have to go. So she hung up her phone and mom got out the game. Dad lit the candle on the table. Good idea. What are they doing? They're playing the game together as a family, aren't they? The end. So technology is a good thing because we get to watch each other today. You get to watch me reading a book. You can watch different things on your computer with mom and dad. You can play games, but you know what? A lot of times it's nice to turn off technology and sit together as your family. Mom and dad can read a book to you. You can play board games. You can go play outside. So technology is a good thing. We get to see each other and read stories together, but it also needs to take a rest sometimes so that we can be together as families. So have fun today with your technology and have fun with your families also. See you later, guys.